Today, we've got a 355 cubic inch Chevrolet engine here in my little race car, and we're gonna adjust the valves on. We've already taken the valve covers off just to save a little bit of time. And uh, now the first thing I wanna go through with you, is we're gonna talk about firing order, okay? So let's go ahead, we got a little whiteboard here. And on a Chevrolet engine, whether it be a small block or a big block, firing order is one, eight, four, three, six, five, seven, two, okay? And let me just draw a little picture of an engine here. We're gonna draw a little engine, just as we're looking at it here. We'll pretend like this is the front of the vehicle down here, like this is the radiator, okay? And here's the air cleaner on the engine, and we're gonna draw eight cylinders, okay? Four on each side. And on a small block Chevrolet, number one is on your driver's side, okay? Number three, number five, and number seven. All the odd cylinders are on the driver's side, on the passenger side, or your even cylinders. Two, four, six, and eight, okay? Now to make things go a little smoother today, I'm gonna to show you two different styles of adjusting valves, but each one of them, we're gonna follow the sequence of the firing order, okay? So we'll be adjusting cylinder number one first, then number eight, then number four, then number three, then number six, and then five, and then seven, and two, and we'll be complete, okay? So friends, stay 